This is CBeebies on YouTube. Find even more fun and games for your child at the CBeebies website. Jack and Nori, Jack and Nori. Jack and Nori. Hello. Minnie and I are reading another story from the Bedtime Stories book for Rebel Girls. You probably remember, this is a book all about famous women and girls who did something amazing to change their life or the lives of others. Today's story is all about a lady called Alec Weck. Now you might not have heard of Alec Weck, but Alec is a supermodel from a country called Sudan in Africa. Now once upon a time, there was this girl named Alec who would stop by a mango tree to get a snack on her way home from school. Alec lived in a very poor village. There was no running water, there was no electricity. She had to walk to a well if she wanted to drink water, but she and her family lived a simple and happy life. Then, sadly, a terrible war broke out and Alec's life changed forever. As the warning signs wailed over the village, Alec and her family had to flee they had to run away from the fighting and from the life that they'd known. It was the rainy season. The river had flooded, the bridges across it were underwater, and Alec could not swim. She was terrified of drowning, but her mom helped her cross over the river and get safely to the other side. Along the way, Alec's mum traded packets of salt for food and passports because they didn't have any money. Months later, they managed to escape the war and made their way to London in England. Now, Alec was very different to all the other girls in England. She looked different, she talked different, and as a result, she was teased by all the other boys and girls who she met. But one day, Alec was in a park with her mum when a talent scout from a famous modeling agency met her. He wanted to recruit Alec as a model but Alec's mum was a bit afraid and she said, no, I don't want to hear about it. My Alec is not going to be a model. But Alec thought that this was an opportunity to make a better life for her and her mum. And she begged her mum, please, please let me try. Now Alec, who previously had been teased because she looked different and sounded different, all of a sudden she stood out in a good way. She looked so different from any other model that she instantly became a worldwide sensation. Alec wanted to be a supermodel for one reason. She wanted everyone on the planet, every girl in the world to know that you're beautiful. It's okay to be quirky, she said. It's fine to be shy. It's okay to be different. You don't have to be like everybody else. When beauty shines from within, there can be no denying it. And that's the story about how a little girl from a village in Sudan became a world famous supermodel. Right Minnie, time for bed. Oh, yeah.